What's up guys, this is Tampa Tech and got my fan in today from Amazon, my $36 fan, and it's broken. But before I return it to Amazon, I wanna to try to fix it just to see what can possibly go wrong in a brand new fan. This fan is brand new, $36, great deal. And I wanna find out why it broke. Probably something shipping related, I think which is the most common for brand new products. So it's plugged in and this is, I have my meter right here. So just to show you, it's not turning on with the button or the remote. It is plugged in and I know it's plugged in because check this out. I have my voltmeter right here. I'm gonna put it on, not DC volts, but AC volts. So I got special probes that I can pierce the cord. I have my probes plugged into, well, not plugged in, but I have my probes pierced through the cable and I am reading good voltage. So you got voltage going into the fan, but the fan doesn't turn on. On this plug, there is a fuse. You just slide this up and you can check the fuse right in here using a meter. Let me go ahead and get my meter, but we already checked the voltage. I know it's good, but just to show you in case you don't want to pierce the cable, which I don't blame you. I don't really recommend that. So right here, I have it in continuity mode and we're going to check it. Put my probe on one side of that fuse and the other side. If I get a tone, it, the fuse is good. So the fuse is good. There's screws right here. Sometimes if you squeeze plastic up, unclip it. Oh, there we go. So these are just small tips. Oh, I could just slide this off. Duh. Let's go ahead and pop this off. Oh, there's a spring in here. It's like some kind of spring. Oh, this, yeah, it's like a spring or something. The board's not cracked. And that's a good thing. And the wire looks good. I mean, that's not, actually, it's a bad thing because we still got to find out what's wrong with it. That's what we're trying to do, just find out the bad part. So let's take the screw out and then unclip it. Come on. Make sure you always unplug the power or else you get shocked. There we go. Every, oh crap, this thing came right unplugged. This doesn't look good. This looks flimsy and this wire fell out. Let's zoom in on that just so I can show you. Now you can see how crappy this plug is. It just poor design and look just the wire is just not it's just loose in there undo this right here and this side there we go and this whole thing should come out boom There we go. There we go. that put that and there's I don't think there's any way these two wires are gonna touch 
but you can hot glue it right there if you feel like it might touch. Spring is giving me a hard time. Push it back more. Oh, there it goes. Ah, that's how you do it. You have to go all the way back with it. It works. So guys, if this video was informative, give me a big thumbs up. And if you want more how-to videos like this coming your way, subscribe, hit that bell notification to stay updated on the latest videos. And if you know anyone with a broken fan, hit that share button, share this video to them. Thanks for watching.